afternoon, this is LNER Class A4 double four six eight Mallard, built on the 3rd of March 1938, retired on the 25th of April 1963. It was in steam until 1988, there was 35 of these locomotives built, 6 have been preserved, it's a Hornby model, R3676, I've put crew in and I've put coal in it. And Mallard is a holder of the world speed record for a steam locomotive doing 126 miles per hour on the 3rd of July 1938. I did do an earlier review on this three years ago, but my model railway was totally different then, and so was my videoing skills. So anyway, I hope you're going to enjoy seeing this run, and thank you very much for watching. Here's the radius two wide points test, all in sort frog points. There's not going to be a problem with this because it's absolutely loaded with pickups. We're just going to take it round for you. It's always evocative, Mallard in Garter Blue. Okay, this is a radius two curve points test or radius twos. And it is finding it very tight. Very, very tight. I can see the bogies are pressed right up against the streamlining. And that is very, very tight. We're lucky we've done it. Computer design, I wouldn't do it again. You can hopefully see how tight the bogies are against the streamlining. But it's done it. But if you were running around pulling coaches with bends that tight, you, it has, it's lost its bogies. It's just too tight for it, far too tight. Computer says yes, skirted A4 says no. Thank you. These are Backman coaches, apart from the one with the grey roof, which is a Hornby coach. Here's a nice panorama of Mallard and its other NERT carriages.
And here we are pulling 10 LNERT coaches of mixed stock. It's a bit of a slope there so you can hear with the inertia of the carriages. It did struggle a little bit. And here comes Mallard. And from my old review you will no doubt see how much the track has changed. Here we are at Pace, Express Mallard, It is finding is the wheels are slipping a little bit with these 10 carriages. But you've got to remember you've got the inertia of all these carriages pulling. And that's why it's so important to have your track flat. Because if it's not, a coach that is pretty innocuous will come off. Here comes Mallard, and you just see the coaches in the background. And here it comes into view. Now you're going to see Mallard go through the points crossover. And it is so important that your track is dead level when you're pulling all these carriages. Because the inertia of everything pulling and pushing is immense.
the carriage at the back can take out the one at the front if it's tugging because the track isn't level or straight. And here's Mallard going through the points crossover. And you can see it's a walk in the park.